whether or not the allegations surrounding our gubernatorial candidate are true. We should do something urgently. Mr. President, sir, my party chairman, I greet you all. This is politics we all know. And in politics, we all know what is involved. Which blackmail is one of the great strongholds to pull people down? The so-called fake results scandal you all are talking about. It's just a conspiracy to pull me down, to hinder me from becoming the governor of this great state. But I assure you people, I assure you, I promise you that in a very short time, it won't be long, I will come out clean. I assure you that. Um, <coughs> party chieftains, I, I want to say that um, Dr. Bolaji's uh, observations are not far from the truth. The issue of the scandal, I want to assure you, is of personal concern to me. The mothers are in court. But I want to assure you that at the end of the day, our gubernatorial candidate, Senator Joy, shall emerge victorious. Is this not a private robbery? I won the primary election. I am clean. I don't have a scandal. But a unanimous agreement. I am the supposed candidate. Here we are, discussing of somebody who has a scandal to clean up. Mr. President, my party chairman, this is not fair. Engineer Samson, this matter is in court. Why don't we allow the courts to do their duty? The election petition tribunal, Claire Senator Williams of the alleged certificate forgery, leveled against her by her opponent. The trial judge, Justice Musa Aka, ruled out the end of the deliberation that evidence tendered against the senator does not prove there is any forgery and that the certificate of the senator has been confirmed to be authentic. Now, the new. Senator, congratulations! Congratulations! congratulations. Thank you. Am I not the president of the country? Thank you Congratulations, Mom. Thank, thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. But, 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 um, I mean, the evidence against you in the court, sincerely, it was so overwhelming. I mean, how, how could you fake your result like that? You know, you don't even look like, well, you're not schooled. Come to think of it, you look so educated, so articulate. I even like a, like a PhD holder. Your Excellency, who doesn't have skeleton? Uh, we all do. Uh, we all do. What the good thing is that I'm crying. Uh, Senator, no, 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 no. This skeleton, this very skeleton, is indeed a very foolish skeleton. Senator, where have you been when your mates were going to school? You were busy, pew, 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 pew. Your Excellency. Yeah, I am still. Thank you. Thank you. Your Excellency. Oh, uh, party chairman, Dr. Will, is here to see you. Do I have an appointment? I don't think so. Then I don't want to see him. Your Excellency, my in law, please let him in. Let Dr. Bolaji in. I want to see him. I want to see him. I want to see how he will look into my eyes when he hears I am victorious. I want my joy to be a mockery to this race. Is that what you want? Excellence, please. Yes, sir. That's what I want. Fine. Your Excellency, the Senator. My chairman. Dr. Bolaji, um, 
do I have an appointment with you? Of course not. But I couldn't hold myself from addressing you over this matter. You and I know that the evidence presented in that court were quite overwhelming. But you influenced the judgment so that you are in law declared innocent. Am I not? You are not. You know that you are not. It is bad enough that you are the senator of this country. And out of greed and avarice, you still want to govern this state. You have forgotten that you are in retreat. Dr. Bolaji, you have made your point. You see, I was in a good mood before you came in. And I wish to return to that mood. Lawrence. Some people just hate other people's progress. I don't know. I don't know why you're making this personal. Your Excellency, you should be yourself. We got your boss. Thank you. For the past four days, no form of communication, no test, no emails. What happened? Where are you coming from? Like you care. And what do you mean by that? What do you mean I don't care? And you care. Where did you take my husband to? And why was your phone ringing without you being here? Excuse me, what kind of question is that? I just came back and met him at the gate. Yes. yes. Where has he been for the past four days? Please, don't join me with your domestic and marital issues. Just sort things out with him. I'm in my room. Well, I, I think I'll do so. You know, not so fast. Until you tell me where you are coming from for the past four days. Did you just drag me? I'll do worse than that. <laughs> Like you just drag me. Yes. Oh, yeah. Okay. Are you serious? Ramsey! Ramsey! You have to tell me what you are coming for! Yeah, I did, and I tried calling you, but it's like your phone is switched off. Oh, perhaps it's in the talk. You know, I'm actually using this cheap phone. I really need to cover up my hands today. Yeah. Now, according to the text message, it says they're going to have a meeting at a certain guest house tomorrow. Yes. Uh -huh. Okay, listen. Here is my plan. Okay. I need you to send your boys to the street to get a stolen phone from me. Okay. You know, and afterwards, you're going to send Ramsey a text message. I need you to convince him. I repeat, convince him, then dispose the phone afterwards. Now, what do you want to achieve for this? What's your motive? Listen, every man has an ego. If Ramsey walks into that hotel and sees both of them together, I know Ramsey, there will be bloodshed. And I don't want to miss out the action. Yeah. I need it to take. Yeah, yeah. No, you are truly a journalist. Okay, see, I have someone who can arrange a meeting between us and his security man. Hmm? Now we can make him an offer he will not reject while he covers the event for us. How about that? Okay, but how does he hope to achieve that? Sweetheart, don't worry. 
I got it. If you say so, I trust you. Very well. Now, I've got to go on. Like, seriously. Come on, now. You just came. Like, I have to leave. Like, Baby, come on. Hey, okay. hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. So, bro, yeah. what took you so long? Man, I have to make sure nobody's watching you. Are you that security conscious? You never know. You never know. So, what's up? I hope it's well covered. Uh, yeah, of course. It's perfectly covered. Okay, open it for me. Yeah, always count on me, man. This is good. Yes, it's good. So, um, bro, you have to leave the country like we agreed, right? Of course I will. I need to think. I need to think. I'm not in the mood. 
sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry if I touched you so much. But I'm sick. Please. Did you just stop? Whatever condolence you brought here, thank you very much. But you see, right now, you have to leave here. And it's big. What is wrong with you? And why are you suddenly beginning to, to, to treat me like a piece of trash? I mean, you weren't like this. We started this right from when we were 14 years. Since you met that girl and proposed to her, you just changed. Why are you doing just this? Think about that. What's wrong with you? I can keep quiet because it's getting out of hand. Just, 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 just stop. Just stop. 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 Have you looked for her in the room? I've searched for that girl everywhere in this compound inclusive. Where is she? Besides, why are you looking for her in such anger? I'm talking to you. Why is one? I'm very sorry to say this. I don't mean to disrespect you. And I don't doubt your charm at all. But I think the charm you gave to me, it didn't work. No, I'm saying it didn't work because my husband is coming back from Malaysia. And I'm still staying at the boys' quarters. He still insists that he will write his will and send me away. Somebody is using their juju to spoil your juju. Who could that be? I mean, I, I don't understand. Now, watch closely. Hey. Serum! Hey! So they still listen to Juju? Who did this charm for this girl? This girl is going to evil. I'll be princess with the two reasons. If you bring in another money, I will do another Juju. Yeah, 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 do you remember how we had to work at sites? Can we sand and cement just so you could go to school? My sister, why all these memories? Do you remember how Mama sold her apas and her jewelry so we can eat? Yes, I remember. Do you want to go back to that point? God forbid, Barton. I'd rather kill than go back to such a life. That is the spirit. And my husband comes back from Malaysia tomorrow. He intends to throw me out, divorce me, and change his will. Sister, how did you get that information? I have my informants. So the only option left for us now is to kill him. God forbid. When did you now become a murderer? When did you become a fool? Do you want to go back to point one? I have seen billions. I have lived in luxury. I will not leave the billions I have seen and go back to millions. Only option we have is to kill him.
How can I help you? Yalla. My mother has really told me a lot about you. She told me that you will help me out in my predicament. My marriage is crashing. My husband doesn't love me anymore. He beats me up. I, I don't know what I have done wrong. Please help me. So what is it that you wanted me to do? Please, I... I want you to do something. So that my husband can love me back. Do you have his picture in here? And his picture? Yes, I, I have his picture here. Ha, huh. this is very awesome. You will leave in the picture in here so you can go. He will start loving you. I don't understand. I, I should leave my, my husband's picture here and go. That he will start loving me again. But you don't know the fade or about the good transfer. I said go in no, me will start loving you in. Thank you. I'm grateful. Yeah. Yeah. Eva. Yeah. Eva. Well, how did it go? Madam, we met another group which I believed had a similar motive. We started firing at each other. Madam, it is painful to say I lost all my men. So what happened at the end? The chief was finally down. Are you sure of this? Yes, madam. Just what I wanted to hear. Apollonia thinks she could rub shoulders with me. Now her sponsor is dead. Well done, my dear. I'll definitely see you later. Thank you, ma'am. This is the president's son. Besides, he's married. I beg, forgetting that. He married, he said, what is now? If you marry him, go ahead. What do you want to to that one? See, I swore to him. Married or no marriage, I swore to him. Listen, babes. <laughs> this is not as easy as you're saying it. Do you understand? This is not easy. Have you forgetting I have spiritual power in you? See, look at you. So I know they this mess medicine so see dear. You be teaching me how to dress, how to cook fine, how to combine everything. Go to yellow slipper, slipper on black, how I be doing everything. Then another thing is that I want you to tell me how to sing. Please. <laughs> this is so not going to be easy. But there's this club he comes to every weekend. Sometimes he comes with his wife and sometimes he comes alone. Now, 
this is what we're gonna do. Just pray he comes to the club this weekend alone. But you have to start going to the gym. Like you really need to look sexy if you want to get his attention. See, Ran, that is not a problem. See, is it not to the gym safe for him? I be gym safe for him. I be sexy for him. Ah, and again, this is your gutter language of a thing. You really need to drop it. Like, you really need to work on your English, the uh, way you speak. Tira, Tira, I, I, I spoke English very well. I spoke English very well. I spoke, I spoke, I spoke, I try. I, I do everything. I do. And again, don't tell him you're a spiritualist. Do you understand? Okay, Tira. See, Tira, how do you still say? I want, to, I want to be doing like you now. I want to be, you know, like I do sex in it. You do. Hello, good afternoon. Thompson, meet me in the car. Okay, yeah, I'm coming. So, madam. Sorry, my name. Oh, of course you don't know me, but I know you. Serious? Yeah. Please, Mark, can I have your contact? I would like to call you. Something very important I need to discuss with you. Something very important. I hope there's no problem. Of course not. Please. I'm not, yes. No, madam, this place is not conducive for what I'm about to tell you, please. Let me just have your number. I'll call you very much later, please. My number? Thank you very much. I'm sorry, madam. What did what you hear? My husband is sick. I can't see him. Yeah, please do see me well to him. of a baby girl and she was being given a boy. <sighs> that is hallucination. She's saying things. I don't think so, sister. I doubt. Okay. You had a scan, right? Before delivery. And then you showed a boy. Yes. Oh, sister. How come after delivery they gave you a girl? Same hospital. Same time. Another woman delivered of a baby girl. No, it can't be what I'm thinking. <laughs> do you have a contact? Of course, sister, I do. <sighs> no. DNA's test of Mrs. Ogar's baby matches with Mrs. Lawson's baby. Oh! And Mrs. Lawson's baby, Mrs. Ogar's baby. Hey! I said it to God! Could have done this kind of mistake. My instincts never lied on time. I felt it. You think I resented my husband because he don't have a girl? Oh! Sister, okay. We are deeply sorry for this and uh, we'll make sure we bring documents for you. To sign so that at least she can take her baby and you will take your baby. We are sorry for the discomfort this has caused you. This hospital! I thought it was done! I thought you Hey! I knew it! My scan told me I was having a boy! I was so to get me a girl! How do I know it's not mine? Very good, that's why we have gone this DNA test. 
eyes to make sure that you know who maybe is who. You are sorry. You are sorry. sorry. Your husband is sorry. You were all loyal to my late husband. I demand that same level of loyalty. The good days are not gone. In fact, things are getting better. All I demand from you is your total cooperation. And please, please, do not try to outsmart me because I'm a woman. I'm certain you will not like the outcome. So, back to the matter at hand. We have a new delivery and a new client in Spain. Madrid, precisely. He'll be waiting for the delivery in three days. That's when he wants the transaction to take place. Yes, I've seen to all the airports and all the checkpoints. They're all under control. Good. I like to hear that. And make sure every single person working under you is well taken care of. Make sure they're professionals. No stories this time. I'll be taken care of. Gentlemen, that will be all for now. Uh, you, can, you can do it. Listen to me. If you want Ramsey to look at you, you have to look sexy and fit. Do you understand? Look at you. Before we go. So, I am looking sexy for my love. Yes. <laughs> I didn't know you were this ambitious. Okay, um, is this not supposed to be my housemate? Well, let's just say I'm going to pick for the job. And here, what are you doing at the gym? You're supposed to be at your place. I mean, the shrine. Sis, sis, let me tell you something. Stop insulting me. Stop insulting me. It is so obvious I'm not going to be dealing with phones like you. I'm manager. I must say I do concur because I am certainly not sharing this gym. I tell you. Oh, I'm going to you. Oh, pardon my manners. My name is Mrs. Lawson Adakole, also known as Mrs. Dowd. So, where's the manager, please? Well, I am the president's son's wife. <gasps> and Senator Joy is my mother. <gasps> Do you have a name? Is there any? Oh my goodness. I am so scared. <gasps> goodness, I'm going to that. Help me. Help me, please. Pick me up. Help me. <laughs> my goodness. So you are the president's son's wife. And the daughter of that that illiterate who mistakenly become a senator. What's her name again? Joy, yes? You dare speak of my mother. And that's mama. Oh, calm down, child. Calm down. You should. She has guards. Good for you. Manager! Manager? Yes. Hello, how are you? What's up? I'm sorry. I have goosebumps all over my body. My God, I feel so terrible. I am so irritated. I never knew you allow Miss Grant into this gym. Ah, but I would gladly offer you two million dollars to have them thrown out. Okay, anything for you. I'll do it. No, 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 no. She's my friend. Is. She's my friend. Is. She's not going. Is. Oh, very well then. Not everybody likes the things of life. Have them all thrown out, and I hope you can carry her. Mm -hmm. Manager, well, I will be giving you five million naira to throw those fools out of here. Because I can't. Yes. Hey. Now my heart is broken. I feel so terrible. Not for me. Wow. I mean, you are schooled, manager. So I'm certain you know about the senator that's an illiterate. That happens to be her mother. Not only is that person her mother, the girl can do more than five million. 
It's okay, child. Don't feel bad. It's fine. Well, manager, I will give you 12 million naira to have them all thrown out and an extra 1 million naira to do it violently. My wallet? You got it. It's a deal. Come on, let's go. Let's get out of here. So, I will be the man of millions. So, we can have the chips again. Hey! Oh. 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 I think we should leave. Oh, get away from me. We should leave. circulated as soon as possible. Ma'am, be rest assured that I'll give you the best of my services. But excuse me, madam, if I may ask, did Apollonia actually sell her baby to a woman in just because she couldn't take care of the baby? Hold it right there, young lady. Did you come here to interview me or what? Did you come to interrogate me or do a job? I'm sorry, madam. My friend, you better be. I'm not your mate. You didn't come here to ask me questions. Oh, Mama doesn't have such a wicked heart. She doesn't have a dark heart. Wait, but you say we have a sister all these years. Mother kept it away from us. That is what they are saying. The worst of all, this news is everywhere. People are saying it. It's in the papers. It's in the blogs. It's even on Facebook. Our mother sold her first child. Senator Joy, who is telling this rumor, is so certain about it. The woman is bold. And that is what scares me. Hold on. It's not possible that this woman is cooking all this just to tarnish the image of her mother. I doubt that. I don't know. For a woman of such pair degree, it's a stupid thing to do or say. I mean, maybe you're right. Maybe she's just trying to, you know. Calm down, boys. Calm down. I haven't come here to shed blood. I came to see the illiterate senator. Your mother, my name. What is going on down here? I see that the almighty illiterate senator decides to grace us with her presence. Her cheap presence at that. Who let this thing in? I mean, I mean, what, what, what's going on here? How dare you refer to me like that, you little chick? I'm illiterate. That's what you are. Because if you are educated, you will not be spreading such, such cheap lies, such rumors about my mother, just to tarnish her image. My mother like that. Call me Yes. Lies. Well, my dear, here, 
same guy you cried for last two weeks and, and, you, and you said you can do anything for to make me happy. Ha -ha. Greggy, I said he's tiring. He's not hearing. Greggy, I stuck it fine now. I stuck it fine now, fine now. It's not loving you again. I smell, I smell what see you again. Yes? Come see, who is that? Come see. Hey. Ah. 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 That was quite harsh. <laughs> Forget that one. It's tanky, tanky, tis. Please, um, my dear Ramsey, please sit him down. Sit him down. Stop, 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 stop. Sit him down. Wow. Well, uh, nice place you have. I wasn't expecting you to. You know, leave it in the flat. <laughs> so, uh, how are you? I'm fine. Are you? Yeah, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. So, um, what is your poisoning? Excuse me? Your poisoning. I, I don't understand. Your... Oh, my poison. Okay, my poison. And what's funny? My friend, will you get out of here? That's what's. Faust! <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, if you have brandy now. Okay, let me get you. <laughs> No, seriously, you crack. You crack me. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. So now, <laughs> really, I, I tell you, you do fascinate me. You you crack me up big time. I'm telling you, I I I, I really do connect with you. Like seriously, 
you know, I like you, I like your person. Yeah, yeah, and um, I want to get to know you a whole lot better. Now, for example, you do know my name, right? Oh, I am knowing your name now, and I'm saying. Okay, and I know your name. Um, yeah, so let's go family. Um, tell me something I don't know about you. Like, you know your family? Where they are, what do they do? I I I snow having any families. I snow having mother and no father. I snow having brother and sister and no. Is one woman pick me and chase me. I is also and also also. I is not having education. Forgive me, okay? I'm, I'm not really laughing at you. Really, yeah, I'm, I'm not, okay? Yeah, look. I like you. I, I, seriously, I've never seen a natural soul like yours. I've never. No airs, no whole part. You know what? I want to connect with you. I want to be part of your family. Really help you out in whatever way I can. And I stay true to that. I appreciate it. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you. I can condone anything in this world, but not mother. How can you people condone, commit mother? I'm so ashamed of you. We are the ones who ought to be ashamed of you. Yes. We are family. We fight for each other. We stand by each other. We trust each other. We tell each other the truth. You lied to us all these years. You sold your first child because you felt you couldn't take care of her and you couldn't even tell us. How could you, mother? How could you? Mother, we loved you. We never hid anything away from you. Only for us to find out that we have an elder sister wallowing away in pain and agony. Gosh, mother. Oh, my no, 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 no. It's a lie, and then you kneel to say you're sorry. Just let me talk. I've had enough. I no, no. I have had about enough. You, how? Oh, get your hands off me. Let me, let me say something. So it is. Get your hands off me. So it is true after all, mother. Oh, I have to say something, please. I regret the day I called you, mother. Oh my goodness. Well, thank you so much for coming, ladies and gentlemen. I must say thank you for honoring this invitation. Without wasting your time, let me quickly explain to you why I called for this emergency CPP executive committee meeting. We all know that my late husband, Chief Lawson, was a financial pillar and leader of this great party. As his widow, I haven't called this meeting to take his place. Of course not. I have called this meeting because the financial vacuum has been empty. So I want to inform you, or rather reassure you, of my firm support financially to this great party. Thank you. Inside the envelopes being shared is a sum of 10 million naira each in check. Now more of that will come your way. My wish is granted. <coughs> this is a rare treat. On behalf of this great party, I say thank you. Thank you um, we shall also look into your requests 
and see what can be done. Exactly. Once again, thank you. You're welcome. Well, my wish is none other than to be the next governor of the state under this great platform. Your mother is our candidate. Yes. Yes. There can always be a switch of candidates. But she has been cleared and is far in her campaign. She's a movie star and a face we can use to get more votes. Mr. Donald, are you with me on this or against me? My mother is a superstar. Yes. Yes. My mother is Claire? No. So you say. Wait until you see her records of unpaid taxes. Now that alone can disqualify her, right? Uh, Madam Sonia Lawson. This will cause great confusion and setback for the party. I, 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 I thought the person in question is your mother. Don't give me problems, Mr. Donald. I'm not disputing the fact that she is my mother. The goat is not stupid to always stick with the man who holds the palm from it. I have the money. Now campaigning will never be a problem. Stick with me, Paul. Your pockets will smile far better than your faces. Mr. Donald, let's be very careful. Yes. Let's be very, very careful. Yes. This has never happened in this party before. Not at all. I see my mother couldn't even wait to get down from her car. So, here is Sonia, the desperate queen. What can I do for you, child seller? No, 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 no. I did not sell my child. I'm very soon, the truth will be known by all. Till then, see how desperate you have become. You are screaming with the party executives to switch my candidacy with yours. I thought I had a daughter in you. I never knew you were such a decorated, desperate monster. Thank you very much, Mama. But do not forget that desperation seems to run the blood of the family, starting with you. Yes, that same desperation that drove you into selling your first child for money is the same desperation that I have. I hate you, and I will never forgive you for it. You see that government house? <laughs> you will never smell it. As long as I am Sonia, you doctored your birth certificate. You are not up to 35, as the 1999 constitution demands. Your age is a barrier. And you forgot that the person you are up and against is your biological mother. <laughs> no, Wahala. Let's see how it goes. Because very soon, your original birth certificate will be in all the newspapers. Mama, you will lose. Say what? <laughs> no problem. Let's see who loses, even with your so called money. Rubbish. <laughs> Who's out the door? Baby, it's me. Tira. Tira. Who's expecting you? Are you with someone? Come on, don't be ready with us. Baby, you have to be careful. Huh? Put yourself in trouble. Listen, I am being careful. Okay? You are. I had to leave early to avoid being caught. So, um, what about our plan? You mean the poison? Of course. Listen, I took the poison. What? I 
had to take the poison to avoid being caught. Baby! What is this? I had to take it to make it look real. I had to. Don't Baby. forget I have the antidote. What are you doing? What are you doing? I have the antidote. Come, come, come. What is it? Yes, madam. You have a mail. From who? Uh, I think it's from your daughter, Sonia. Let me have it. Thank you, madam. gift I sent must have reached you by now. I have plenty copy of it where that came from. You said you'll post the original of my birth certificate on net. Well, Mama, think of what I would do with these photos before you do so. I know you'll be asking, wondering, when did you do this? You don't have to worry your old brain, Mama. All the security men were assigned to you by my late husband. He pays them, so they see me as their boss. I use them to accomplish this. I guess you never knew when you were drugged. He suffered. 
He went through so much poverty and he died an unhappy man. We suffered. You were at home two years after you graduated. I wrote jam six times. Not because I couldn't pass. But because I had to train you in school, no one was there to train me. To think that we went through all that suffering, all that suffering, everything we went through because of what she did to that child. So, so, this is where all this is coming from. This is the reason why you're doing all this. Huh? When I first heard about the rumor, I thought she was going to say it's a lie. But what did I hear? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, I can't forgive her. I could forgive everything, but not this. I could never forgive that. I hope this party executives meet so with her dialogue and solve the confusion that is crippling the activities of this party. Sonia is of the view that no primary election was conducted before making Apollonia our flag bearer, which is against the constitution of this party. But we all know how it happened and why. So we are all going to vote. If you are for Sonia, you raise your hand. And if you are for Apollonia here, you don't raise your hand. Are we all ready? Very well. If you are for Sonia, raise your hand. Oh, that is it then. Who we'll also the primary election? I can see that most of you have a bride. But not to worry. She's still my daughter. If she wins, I win. You rely, Mama. My victory can never be yours. Come on, don't worry. We know how to play the game. Be my guest. What have I seen
Sorry, Excellency. Sorry, Mr. President. Your Excellency, there is a situation here. What is wrong with me, Doc? What is wrong with me? I'm afraid it's a bad news. Doc, if it was a good news, I will not be sitting down here with you. I have a lot of other important things to do. What is wrong with me? Come on! Your Excellency. Yes. It's food poisoning. Meat, food poison. As a matter of fact, the bacteria is rare and cannot be identified easily. However, a series of tests will be done. Did you say food poisoning? Yes, Your Excellency. My spirit mothering appearing to me in the shrines, telling me that this voice is my brother. Wait, why did you get a speech from? Where did you get this picture from? Senator Joy that brings it to me. I know him. This is Tomsi, Apollonia's son. Then go to the house. Here, yeah, go to the house. This is why I come in here. I want you. I want you to follow me there. You know you're my only friend. Yeah, now listen. You know you're my friend. I can do anything for you. But I'm loving you too. You can't. Oh, I'm confusing. You don't have to. You have to act fast. I'm confusing. I just wonder. I just wonder who could have poisoned Father. I mean, how? Don't worry. Just cheer up. Father will be fine. Now, tell me, who has been taking care of you all this while? I have a wife. What? My problem is, how, how, why is somebody should just... Yeah, hello. Just listen to me. Can we just talk? Well, hello, hello, hello. My God! My God! My God! Who 
was that? <gasps> What's going on? Baby, where is this one going to? Can't even reach him on the phone.
What's happening? Why are you talking like this? Why are you saying this to me? Yeah, because today you, 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 you came into my life. I was. I can't understand. I mean, I, I'm, I'm not part of this crime and I'm receiving repercussions for it. I was told that God girl's entire family was caught up in the inferno. How come she survived? Well, it's obvious she wasn't in the house because she wasn't attacked by fire. Now listen, son. I am not going to allow that child of a nobody mess up my life. Search for her. Dig her up. Search every nook and cranny of this country for her. I want her dead. Do you understand? I want her dead. N -n Nancy. Yeah, 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 N Nancy. See, my wife saw a picture of Nancy on my phone and recognized her and said, Nancy and Tyrion are friends and they attend the same gym together. And who is Nancy? Some funny girl I got acquainted with at the club. Good. Very good. Find Nancy. I am sure she would give us a clue to where that girl is. I want her dead. But Chairman, this young lady you're talking about, have you met her before? She just called her. She has an implicating document that will need Senator Joy. Uh, hello? Okay, let her in. I can't wait to see this evil woman go down. Good evening, sir. Thank you. Thank you. My name is Linda Adakole, the only surviving family member of Honorable Martins Adakole. Honorable Martins? Yes. But I thought they said all these people died in a fire outbreak. Yes. But I was not a monk. And I know you were both aware that it was masterminded by Mr. President and Senator Joy Williams. And that is why I have this documented evidence you can use in bringing down Senator Joy Williams. This is interesting. Are you sure about what you're talking about? Very sure. Ramsey! What is he saying? You is coming to my house and you is not phoning me, you is not calling me. You is still okay? Do you know who Tyrone Benson is? Is. Do you know who Tyrone Benson is? Tyrone is my friend. Where does she live? Huh? I is not knowing. I said, where does she live? I is not knowing. Now look at my face, okay? Take a look at me. Do I look like I'm laughing? Do you see a smile on my face? Okay, that means I'm not the same Ramsey you used to know. So answer my questions. Now, where does Tyrion Benson live? Are you see, Ramsey, your his face is commoting here, he's firing. Why now? I say I not knowing. Boy, 
boys. Father, look, that girl's real name is not Nancy, no. Her real name is Iyala, and I'm telling you, she is mystical, she is spiritual. She, she possesses some kind of powers. I, I mean, you need to have seen the way she, 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 she just disappeared. And, you know, escaped our fold, just, just, just like that. I know. She is a strong spiritualist. Yes. I, I was a friend to the woman that brought her up before she died. But the question is, what is the link between her and Tiran? I don't know. I, I don't know. I really do not know. You see, when Tira came to my house and, 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 and annoyed me, I tried to slap her and, and she disappeared. Yes, she, she disappeared and, and, and she started attacking me and ordering me as I started doing her and, and I don't know. I, it's simple. It's logical. Huh? They are friends. And they go to the same place to seek powers. So, so what do we do about this right now? Because it's beyond the physical. It's not normal. It's now spiritual. What do we do? My son, my son, I am still the president and commander-in-chief of the armed forces of this country. Let me tell you, nobody, no one can mess up with my life. Huh? Nobody. And...
wrong thing. So, you are married to me and you still sleep with your own sister. What? Don't even give me that. Only the law asked you. My God. How would you be sleeping with your own sister? Listen, don't even say that. He's on the net. Everyone has seen it. He's on the internet. I've seen it. It's everywhere. You can't deny it. <sighs> You're so disgusting. Nonsense. That was the worst day of my life. I left you with my brother Tony to go and find food for all of us. And coming back, I saw my brother's body beside his head. I ran around looking for my lovely baby. Everybody in that compound had to massacre it. Hey. I went to the neighbors. And they all flee for their lives. That was the worst day of my life. I'm stop crying. We are not friendly. And I'm still your daughter, man. I'm sorry. I felt like you'd rather confide in an outsider than us. I was in shock when I heard the rumors little joy was spreading. I should have trusted you. I should have shared in your agony. I'm so sorry I treated you that way. <laughs> You, my children, I have forgiven you all. I want to let you know that I never trusted an outsider more than my own children. Never. <laughs> Senator Joy Williams was my bosom friend. She was my long-time friend. We were so close that we even took an oath never to be party to anything that would kill each other. She only mixed the truth with lies just to turn my children against me. As you can see, it did not work. He has failed. Come, my children, come. I have, I have done so much evil. 
and have lived irresponsible life all this while. I care less about people because I was so desperate in life. And the only source of joy I have is God. God forever. <laughs> Father, <laughs> I was sleeping with my brother. <laughs> I have been an irresponsible daughter to you. <laughs> I just want you to find a space in your heart to forgive me. I'm so sorry. I I have not been a good father to you. Uh, I have lost almost everything that that should make a man happy. Your mother, my wife, and my son, Ramsey. Uh, <laughs> oh. I have been blinded by my singular pursuit for power. But I've lost almost everything. I promise you that whatever is left of my days on this earth, I will be a father to you. I forgive you of all you have done wrong. And I, I ask you to, to forgive me. For, uh, forgive me. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> My friend, 
I invite you now. Please forgive us. To forgive is divine. 